here with you. Um, I think if you look in the like in the role, I'm like an honorary forever member of NABJ. And some of y'all may say, well, what are your qualifications, Ms. Adams? Well, let me tell you, I matriculated from the world-renowned HBCU, Texas Southern University in Houston, Texas, with a major in radio, TV, communications, and a minor in Spanish. Hola. said so eloquently, I have had my syndicated radio show for God knows how long now. If I tell you how long, I can't tell you I'm 25 anymore. So that's number two. Number three, I love finding out the details of what's going on, the issues, and that can be anything. It doesn't have to be political. It can be family, home, uh-oh. Am I in the wrong place? There we go. That sounds better. And so the fourth thing is, I'm naturally nosy. So are those the No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, ma'am. It's pay your dues and be connected to uh, your Houston chapter. That's what that is. So I just wanted to say good morning, good morning. God bless y'all. I know you all have heard the word this morning. You have been blessed by the choir. And uh, we're going to ask them to come in a little while. But I want to sing one of your favorite songs that was requested by you guys that um, I absolutely love singing. I wrote this song in a moment in my life where... You know how it is when you have choices. You, you know, everything starts with a decision. Everything starts with a decision. Us deciding to come to Chicago for this wonderful meeting and communing with one another. And this decision that I had to make was so important. It didn't just affect me and my family. It affected everyone who was around me. And I'm so glad that I made the right decision. God bless y'all.
sing this song. I thank God for the right decision. And sometimes the right decision doesn't feel good to you in that moment. Because the right decision takes some sacrifice in that moment. But if you can look past what's going on right now, and if you can see with that spiritual eye where God is going to take you, and let me just let you in on a secret. No matter how wonderful you can imagine it, God's dream and his plan for your life is so much bigger and better, so much greater and more magnificent. If you just step out on faith, because it's going to take faith to do everything. You have the faith enough to sit at these tables. You have the faith enough to trust that the Hilton got these, got y'all some nice seats that's not going to collapse. So everybody has faith. Just put it in the right direction. You can say like me. It was worth it all. Just be 